Hey guys, Chelsea Carpenter here, Norwex Independent Sales Consultant. I was just going to show you guys today the awesome raw chicken experiment demonstration here, okay? What I'm going to show you is going to blow your mind, all right? Um, I've got a straw just for a dividing line, no other reason. Um, on one side, I'm going to rub raw chicken, and on one side, I'm going to rub raw chicken, okay? But I'll show you how that is important. Okay, what I have here is nasty raw chicken. Let me show you. Okay? Raw, yucky chicken, right? All right, I don't even want to touch it with my hands, so I'm going to kind of leave it in the bag, but I've got my hand behind the bag, and I'm going to rub that nasty chicken all over. Oh, and then I'm going to come over here, and I'm going to rub it some more on this side, okay? So we have raw chicken juices. That nasty raw chicken protein is on both sides. I love chicken, but I don't like raw chicken. So, I'm going to set that chicken aside. Now, what I'm going to show you, like I said, it's going to blow your mind, y'all. I have professional test swabs here. This is what they use in restaurants when people come in to test restaurants to see if they are meeting the standards for sanitation purposes, okay? Um, and if everything is clean like it's supposed to be in restaurants. And that is what these are, just to make sure that it is dirty and it is clean and to, to be able to tell in a scientific way, okay? So I'm gonna go over here and I'm going to take my swab, excuse the crying child, I'm gonna take my swab and I'm going to just rub it all in that raw chicken juices that's on my countertop, okay? Go. Rubbing it, rubbing it. And if it's dirty, it'll turn purple. But if it's not dirty, then it'll turn green. So let's see. So I'm going to stick it back in there, and then I snap this. And then I shake it up a little bit. What color is that at the bottom, y'all? Purple, right? That means it is dirty, yucky, dirty, and it does not meet standards. Okay, now. I have my EnviroCloth, right? With the backlock agent to pull up any bacteria. Okay, all I have on it is water. I've just got it wet with water, right? So I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna clean one side. I'm gonna clean one side of all those chicken juice proteins. Again, I'm sorry about the pan, baby. <laughs> Now, let's try this again. Just water, y'all. Just water. So I have a brand new testing swab. Brand new, never been opened. So I'm gonna rub it on there. Really good. And I'm gonna put it back in there. And I'm gonna snap it to get the the testing solution in there. And I'm gonna shake it up really good. Okay, and what color do we want it to be? We want it to be green. That means that the protein is gone and lifted off of your surface and it's no longer uh, having bacteria on its surface, okay? What color is it? It's green, yay, that means it's clean. Watch this. So, do I have raw chicken all over my cloth? Yes, I do. You think I can get that off? Yes, I can. It will not. I'm just moving my straw because it was moving around anyways. Okay, it will not get onto that surface. All right, let me show you. Let me grab my other testing swab. Okay, another brand new testing swab, never been open. Okay, I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna rub it all over. Move this cloth out of the way. Rub it all over again. Real life here, y'all. Crying baby and all. Okay, so I'm putting it in there. 
So then I snap that. And then I'm going to squeeze the juices down in there. Guess what? The protein and the bacteria did not carry over to the other side when I cleaned it. I didn't even clean my cloth off yet. Off yet. Okay, y'all. It is. It has the protein juices on it, but it will not transfer from one side to the other. Is that not amazing? That is the demonstration that sold me on Norwex products, and it's proven by science, y'all. Thanks for watching.